Hey guys, no frogs today. Got this case CX160 hydraulic excavator. We're going to do a full walk around on this uh, unit, show you every side of it. We'll open the doors, climb in the cab. Uh, going to do a second video that's an operational video on the machine running and working. Uh, you got any questions at all, guys? Please don't just take contact. We're here Monday through Friday, 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. shipping quote just about anywhere in the world. Guys. Running working machine here, guys. Not perfect by any means, uh, but it does run, move, and work. Watch the second video, and we'll demonstrate all of that. This time, it's 102 inches wide. It's legal on the width. There's a pound machine. It's just a permit or anything moving around. Tooth bucket it is uh, got a hole in the in the back of it back here. It's a little big, guys, but it's still big just fine. It's got a thumb bracket. The stick has been plated, I'm guessing, because they had that thumb on there. We do not have the thumb for it. You can order those online. Now the body of the machine has been plated. is out of the cab. That's pretty common. The carriage is decent. machine has got AC components guys. I don't think it is blowing cold, but it does have AC on it. There's your condenser coil right there. It is loose. Got the Cummins four cylinder diesel in it. 4BT. all open and close on it. Looks pretty dry guys. I don't see oil leaking out all over the ground. Serial number DAC 162465 stamped in the front of it right there. There's a 160. Aluminum tag is missing, but these are all stamped in the frame right there. DAC 162465. Make a serial number. Pretty dry looking machine, though, guys. I don't see any, uh, don't see any oil leaking out anywhere. So there's the outside of the machine. If you can you got any questions, don't hesitate to contact us. Please watch the second video.